Oh, oh, holy crap, this is late. I apologize for that, but uh, during a certain part of my year, my life has just gone downhill, and it's really hard for me to function, let alone stay afloat and work on a project, you know? So I got this out eventually, um, but let's, let's get into it. Some of the months, February, April, and July, have gotten claimed, so that will just be an image on this video, but they will be fully releasing later on my Instagram during the months of 2024 that they, you know, existed in for this year. Also, this might seem like it's kind of all over the place, but that's definitely been my year. It's been a roller coaster. But I do have like a theme. There are a lot of these that really resonate with me and mean a lot to me. Specifically, May. May is actually a two-parter. The first scene is just one I thought was really freaking cool. And the second scene is a scene I saw while I was watching, and I was like, I need to dub that because that's just something I need to hear and I need to say out loud. Um, so I decided to put both of those in there because I really loved that character and loved that show. Also, October was supposed to be a two-parter, but the second part got claimed, so I'm probably going to just work harder on that and put it on Instagram sometime later. But December is also a scene that really, really resonated with me, and I'm also going to try to make December like a finale, so it's probably going to be a longer scene, and that's why this one is longer. Last and not least, but also kind of least, um, is August. It might seem unfinished, but I I did that on purpose. Um, if you want to know why, you can ask me about it, or if you know me, you probably know why it's like that. Um, I was dead set on the scene that month, and um, things happened to make that not happen. But I was like, I am still doing this scene, and yeah, I don't know. You, maybe you'll get it when you see it. But yeah, it was fun. I need to map this out better and have this, like, ready before the month of December comes out. But I'll do better next year, hopefully. So thanks for listening, and hopefully you enjoy. Hit it! That's not possible! The bishop assured us! Come, face eternity. Soon you'll be joined by those whose lives you have ruined. Whose souls you have damned. I will not let my sins damn those dear to me. I will redeem myself. Mortal, you are mine. Ichigo, do you know how I hate the rain? It rains in this world, too. If you are ever troubled, the skies become cloudy. If you grieve, it will rain ever so easily. I wonder if you can understand the fear of being rained on in this lonely world. To stop the rain, I shall lend you any strength, any power. If you just have faith in me, I will not allow any rain to fall upon this world. Trust me, Ichigo. As long as I am here, you will never fight alone. Hmm. Wesker, you are alive! This is Wesker. We last met at the 
Spencer Estate, wasn't it? Well, if this isn't one big family reunion. I'd expect you to be happier to see us. Us? So slow to catch on. Jill. Jill, it's me, Chris. What? Are you sure that's her? The one and only. Crap, crap! Don't worry about it, don't panic, don't panic. It's fine, it's cool, everything's fine. So, uh, I might be out of ammo? Bullets! I could really use some bullets! A few 22 calibers would be dandy! Come on, guys! Any time now! I can tell you about it if you'd like. What happens is Don't you bother. I couldn't give a damn about the way I die. The only thing that matters is that I kill who I need to kill. The rest is just details. Now get in my eye. I really don't care what you have to say about it. I'm fighting this battle even if it's hopeless. Feel free to sit back and watch me if you want. Have a nice laugh when I die. Rationally, I get that I'm not capable of doing what I set out to do. But, I also realize that the only way I can go on living is to keep trying. Everyone keeps telling me how my story is supposed to go. Nah, I'ma do my own thing. Even if what he did was wrong, he held true to his beliefs. That's the difference. Ah, that's like a weight off my chest. I see it now. All the dots connected. Why he makes me so angry. Why you irritate me so much. Everything makes sense. <laughs> it's him. The problem is All Might. Yeah, yeah. That's it. That's the most rational explanation. I didn't see it even though it was right in front of me the whole time. What was I worrying about so much? It's simple. He's the reason those morons are able to smile so thoughtlessly. If I can just unlock the secret of its power. Oh. Fiora. This is great. It tastes so good. It's amazing. Not quite. It's always delicious. But today, it's amazing. Yeah. What?
Yeah, I had forgotten what it feels like. I never thought it could be so quiet here. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> A figure watched from the shadows as Gunvolt left the scene. The figure reached down and took a shard that was left behind. Another glaive sample. That's the third one now. The glaives were a kind of vessel which holds an adept's power. Adepts who agreed to transplant their septome into a glaive were promised high social status in our society. Sumeraga gained control over their septimal powers in return. A sword that can only be drawn at Sumeraga's beck and call is a foolish toy. A fiend on a leash is a fiend all the same. An enemy to humanity. But I, not the Supreme God, shall banish all adepts. As a human, I must. There is nothing to be afraid of. I'm your daddy now, Kawaki. <laughs>the great obstacle of good, and justice, the sword in which good can overcome this obstacle and flourish. When I was invited here, I thought you would teach me divine justice. But all you seem to do is watch as these monsters stay in existence with each other's blood. I smell you, Ansem. Show yourself. I have watched you fight. I know your strength. Your skill with darkness has grown and has become more mature. And yet, why? Why do you accept the darkness? but still refuse me. You know you and I are similar. We both follow where the darkness leads. Indeed, we are the same. So why? Does some part of your heart still have a fear of the dark? That's not it. The truth is... <clears throat> I just can't stand your foul stench. You are a fool. You should know my power as well by now. Yeah, I know. Or did you forget? I used all the power you had to give, and Sora still beat me. I'm not at all impressed with your powers. Very well. In that case... You shall sink into the abyss! Ah! Sora. Kairi.
to do this one alone. But you don't mind getting a little help, do you? Huh? Hey, Rico, did you know mice can fly? Oh. What are you making me choose now? Between the road to light and the road to darkness. Neither suits me. I'm taking the middle road. Hmm. Do you mean the twilight road to nightfall? No. It's the road to dawn. Hey, uh, thanks for watching, or listening, I guess. Um, I was just gonna take a second to get serious or whatever, I don't know. Um, but these last couple months have been pretty tough. Um, I've done some, well, a lot of reflection, and some of these obsessions have definitely helped with that. Characters like Riku and Kawaki and Shulk. I have something in common with them, and it's... They all have this task or a burden that they feel like they need to take on by themselves. And... I do the same thing. I have a lot of things that, and issues, and... I feel like I need to push everyone away to save them from me. And... As these characters and stories have shown me, that's not how you're supposed to do it. You need friends. You need people that you can trust. Surround yourself with people that care about you. And so, <laughs> I guess I'm asking if I've slammed the door shut on a relationship or a friendship, something, someone that cared about me, or if you did, um, thinking I would never change or something like that and still happen to care, I don't know, um, maybe, maybe it's time to change that or figure something out, I don't know. I felt really alone lately and yeah, that's partly because I do that myself, when I'm scared I push people away. I am pretty afraid of happiness. And, uh, yeah, so, I don't know, if you're one of those people, um, let me know. And talk to me. Message me on something. Um, uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, so, thanks. Thanks for being here and watching this video and posting to my little separate little thing here. Um, I'm sorry this is, like, super late, but hopefully you had a good Christmas and a happy new year. Later.